What's up kids? Peter Von Panda here. Hey, just drove up here to the Kitt Peak Observatory in Arizona, about an hour south of Tucson. Kind of a long drive up here and a winding road up the mountain, so it's pretty, pretty gnarly, but let's go inside and check it out. The observatory is actually on Native American land and is leased from them in perpetuity. The first place you'll probably want to go to is the visitor center here where it has a gift shop on site. You can also uh, purchase guided tours by docents. You can go to an individual telescope or all three telescopes. It's about $8 per tour. I'd highly recommend uh, going on the guided tours. It provides a lot of information about the facility as well as the telescopes. The campus is much larger than I expected, almost 200 acres and more than a few buildings spread across it. Um, there are a number of experiments and descriptions of the types of work they're doing. We went to the solar telescope, which is being explained here uh, in front of a model of it. It's a very large tubular building that reflects the sunlight down the angled shaft to the bottom to a mirror, which reflects the light back up halfway up the uh, facility to another mirror, which reflects the image down into the research rooms where they analyze and study the images that come in of the sun. The docent will take you on the tour to a, a couple of different buildings. You can actually go on your own tour. This is the dormitory for these researchers that live on campus. It's about $90 a day for them and they usually sleep during the day and work at night. There's actually a basketball court where researchers would usually kill some time waiting for images to develop, but that's not an issue now with digital technology. But in 19 The solar telescope itself is very large and is angled uh, at the same latitude that the facility is at. As I mentioned, you can go into any of the visitor center sections of the telescopes on your own without having to pay. There's usually a door on the side of the telescopes and a little enclosed area where you can go in and view the operation. Not every telescope is open all the time, depending on what types of research is being done. This is the inside of the telescope and you can see the reflector all the way at the bottom. Next, you can go into the visitor center of the solar telescope, which is located just down the hill at uh, the bottom. This uh, mountain is owned by the Tohono O'odham. When you go in, there are some exhibits explaining some of the research and discoveries of the solar telescope. And then at the very end, you can look into the research room itself where the reflectant image uh, is projected down onto the instruments where the researchers then uh, make their discoveries. There's a number of stops along the drive up and down the mountain so you can definitely stop at some of the scenic overlooks and take some great pictures. For the Kit Peak Observatory, Peter Von Panda, out!